Hello everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to make the any tail stand up or stay in the position that you want it to stay on. In this case I have this tail and I want it to stay that way but still have physics. So that's what I'm going to teach you. So let's start. First go to the last bone of the tail, in my case it's the IT bone. I'm going to right click and then go to add, add replica at the end. Then I'm gonna remove this from the AI key and rename it to something else. Then I'm gonna select the bone and move it just a little bit upwards. It's supposed to look like this. Make sure that if it's to the side then you move it a little bit to the side but always that it's like sort of like this. Then, what you want is in the parent bone section to place which bone you want the tail or whatever you're making and to fo what's gonna follow. So, in my case, I want this tail to follow the lower body. In my case, my lower, the lower body bone is 7. In my case, in yours, it might be another number. Then, we're gonna select the bone, go to edit. Selected bone and creating a basic rigid body slash consolidated joint. Click yes. Then go to rigid body. Look for the physic of that specific bone in radius. Place zero. Make sure it's zero. Don't try to place like anything else. The physic is just there so that you can use the joint. Nothing else. It has no other no other usefulness. So just place zero and then follow up bone. It doesn't need to be activated. If you put it in physics, it's not going to work. Then go to the joint and then in the connection A, make sure it's the physic of the bone. It should be named the same. Then in connected body B, you're going to place you're going to select the last physic of the tail, not the first, the last. In my case, it's 8, 1. And that's it. Now you save it. And now you open it in MMD to test it, of course. Here's how it looks. With the physics on, with the physics off, and now with physics on, ta -da! voila, it stays. And you can select the bone and move it around. As you can see, physics are active. And if I place it like this and I click register, if I move the lower body, which is the the bone, I decided that this one will follow. It will still move like that. So you can also change the position you want the tail to be in, and you don't have to be changing and remaking the model and all that stuff, because you can manually move it to whatever you want to. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you want to get notified for more tutorials. Bye bye!